Howdy doody everybody, my name is Kev Gooey and welcome to the long awaited game that we have been waiting for forever. Honey Pop 2 Double Date. I didn't I didn't think that the game would just surprise release. I I, I've been waiting. I've been waiting so 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 long this game and Honey Pop 2 and Honey Pop was was, was oh That game was oh No one can forget that game But yeah, but you guys can get Honey Pop 2 link is down below in the descriptions if you guys want to play it yourself So without further ado everybody We're gonna go right in and there seems to be a lot of girls and a lot of girls we we do know and then there are a lot of girls that we do not know and I want to know all the girls so without further ado everybody here's my mouse moving around we're gonna go right in guys let's do it all right here you go honey pot presents Presents what? According to legends passed down from ages long past, an era of darkness and destruction draws near. Deep within the endless sea of stars, stirs an ancient evil forgotten by time. The Nymphogen. Spirits of limitless lechery lying dormant in the cosmos, awoken only once every 10,000 years by a cosmic super period of unspeakable PMS. With symptoms so severe and desires so destructive, entire galaxies have been consumed by the chaos. It is said that only a hero of unparalleled prowess can overcome the insatiable lust of the demonic pair and return them peacefully to a satisfied slumber. As the dreaded day looms upon an unsuspecting world, no such savior has risen to stand against the threat, and Earth is left defenseless against certain doom. Wait, actually, I might know somebody. Oh, me. Thanks, man. I really needed that. Uh, who, who are you? Mmm, who, who are you? I, who, who are you? I, who, who is this girl? I don't know her. Stranger danger, help. All right. Um, I always happy to help a girl in need. Oh, you're still here? I thought I was done with you. What? No cuddling. No, no cuddling? What, what happened? Sorry, dude. Not tonight. I gotta get back home and start packing. I have a crazy early flight tomorrow. My boss is sending me out to some island for an exotic shoot. Then I'm supposed to meet up with this Teleuber chick for a cross promo we've been planning. Ah, <sighs> it's not easy being a world class fashion model, you know? <clears throat> oh, that's what we're doing. We're doing a photo shoot. Oh, that, that I understand. Oh, we get, we get to. Oh, we move the. Oh. I have to, uh. Get rid of the mouse. I don't know if it's distracting or not, but yeah. Alright. You think that's hard? Try being a world-class pleaser of women. Bon voyage. Try not to miss me too much. Leave the pantsu. I have a thing about collecting the pantsus. That, that, I think, yeah, I remember something like that. Yeah. I can't help you there, Perv. I borrowed this lingerie from the company. I'm pretty sure they need it back. They haven't even released this line yet. 
Now, where did you throw my clothes? Ah, there they are. Well, aren't you at least gonna walk me back to my car? Oh yes, your majesty. Uh, it would be my honor. Shall I carry your belongings too? Yeah, of course. Just let me throw something on real quick. Only if I can get a kiss good night. Do I need to remind you where my mouth has been? You might want to take a rain check on that. Later, sweet cheeks. Keep that thing nice and hard for me for when I get back. Well, 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 look at this motherfucker. I leave you alone for a year or two, and you're banging models on the reg? <sighs> I really am a miracle worker. It Q? Holy... But poop! Where have you been? I missed you. Psh, that's nothing. She's the fourth girl this week. And I, perchance, interest you in some sloppy seconds? Oh, yeah. Oh, you know I love me a messy mulligan. But unfortunately, I'm here strictly on business. Oh. Look, I'm gonna cut right to the chase because time isn't exactly on our side here. Some seriously crazy shit is about to pop off and we need your help to stop it. What's with your swearing? What's with all the swearing? Do, do you need to be swearing all this, this whole time? Like, I'm pretty sure you don't need to be swearing. Uh, I have no idea what you're talking about, but I'll do it. I have a lot of girls to bang this week. You can't find anybody else. As long as, you know, this summer involves my, my, uh genitalia i'm in i don't know but don't don't say that because what if it's in, involves chopping it off i don't i don't know if i'm i'm, I'm into that i have no idea but i'll, I'll do it mm -hmm. i'm glad you feel that way because i definitely wasn't giving you a choice to make a long story short there are these two like evil space hookers that are about to be awoken huh? and if they don't get some wicked good dick they're probably gonna destroy the galaxy. And that would really suck because Earth has some of the finest babes in the universe, next to Tendricide. You see, part of my job as a love fairy is to find a worthy hero among all the pathetic virgins. Unfortunately, we couldn't find one, so you'll have to do instead. Oh. I, I got, gotcha, I think. Consider it done. I mean, I mean, how hard could it be? I've nailed a space trick before. That's true. It's an honor to be chosen for this most sacred duty. I'll do my best. I know you're saying important stuff. But that camo toe is making it very difficult to focus. Wait, wait, what camo? There's a camo somewhere? Where? Where's this camo at? Pay attention! Is my camel toe really more important than the fate of all life on Earth? I don't know what camo. Don't answer that. I'll be honest with you, man. The higher-ups are concerned about your lack of experience with threesomes. But I told him you're a quick learner. Besides, you did bag the fucking goddess of love. That's true. I've got to count for something, right? So, put on some goddamn underwear and pack your bags. Our flight leaves first thing in the morning. I, I do have underwear on. What are you talking about? Anyways, wait, you don't want to sit down and catch up? I haven't seen you in forever. Uh, am I allowed to ask where exactly we're going? You got it. Give me five minutes, I'll be packed and ready to go. Yeah, wait, I haven't seen you in forever. You've been having a frankly dangerous amount of unprotected sex with strange women. And I've been trying to teach other people to do the same thing. There, we're caught up. Can you believe it, man? The old team, back together again for another sexy adventure. Wait, unprotected? Uh, uh. Un un unprotect I can't believe you humans have to get into big machines just to do something as simple as flying. I hate to say it, but if it wasn't for all the honey you guys generate, you'd be pretty useless. Well, can you can fly me, can't can you? What, what about porn? We generate a lot of that too. Are, are, you, are you going to tell me where we're, you know, where we're going yet? I'll remind you that it's a human that's about to save the galaxy. That's me. I appreciate the confidence, but don't overestimate yourself, alright? What we're asking you to pork here is unlike anything you've ever porked before. Uh, speaking of which, I should probably fill you in on the plan, huh? 
we are headed to the beautiful tropical island of Ina de Puna. Why, you may ask? Shh! I'm getting to that. You can ask questions when I'm done. You see, the nymphogen, those are the space hookers, are on the verge of being awoken by their period. If that happens, you can kiss your sorry ass goodbye. So, we need to wake them up before that. There's a volcano on the island called Mount Nymphojaro. Yeah, I don't know who names this shit. If we can get that volcano to erupt, it should be enough to awaken the nymphogen early. But the only way to get that bitch to blow is to offer a sacrifice, a sacrifice of fairy wings. I'm sure you're wondering, what the hell are fairy wings? I thought I told you to stop asking questions. You ever hear the phrase, whenever a threesome is had, a love fairy gets her wings? Yeah, well, that's actually true. So we need to get you mixed up in some menage a trois. As much as I'd fucking love to be more involved, unfortunately, love fairies don't count. Besides, corporate said I have to stop fucking my clients. Can you believe that shit? <sighs> now look, locking down a three-way can be tricky. The best way to do it is by going on double dates. Not the lame kind of double date where it's two couples. The cool kind where it's you and two chicks. You'll need some fresh love fairy tech though. That crusty ass honeybee 4.0 is way out of date. So, da 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 da! Introducing the brand new Honeybee 6XL with threesome compatibility detection package. Go ahead, check it out. When you're done, you can close it by clicking anywhere off the honeybee. You know, it should it should went with uh, 69 XXXL. You, you know, you should have been there. that. That would have been the best. But I, I do have to say, I did not expect a story or, or some crazy story going into this game uh, I have not uh, me no expect at all and also um there's a lot of swearing for some reason I just like like I, I, I like like you I, I understand you know you like you like to be dirty and all but you but you, you the, it's just swearing can be, you know, can, you can die down to swearing a bit. I'm, I'm just saying here, you know, you're not just to die down a bit. I just, um, right? Right? Yeah, right? Why is my webcam so weird? Oh, something's wrong. Mm. Anyways. All right, I got my, my I got my suitcase of of, of pantsuits, a suitcase full of pants. It's the only thing you packed, of course. Of, that, I mean, I need it for uh missions, apparently. Oh, throw can't toss it. I oh man, okay. You can also open and close the honeybee with a simple middle click or tap of the space bar. So uh yeah. I think that's pretty much my entire spiel. Well, for now, at least. Any questions? Uh, nope. That's uh, this, uh, this uh, that all seems pretty straightforward to me. Where did the nymphogen come from, and why are they so horny? Oh, did they really say you have to stop banning your clients? Yeah, I'm. I'm, I'm gonna. I, yeah, I'm gonna. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the second one. I'm, I got a question about that one. You're asking the wrong fairy. That kind of intel is way above my pay grade. I thought I heard a familiar voice back here. <gasps> hey, stranger. Long time no see. Uh, no way. Isn't she that tight-ass flight attendant you used to bang? Oh, man. Can I book a flight or what? Small world, huh? I never thought I'd bump into you on one of my routes. By the way, uh, who were you talking to? Oh, yeah, that's right. I'm invisible. You must look like a crazy person back here. You should probably change the subject before it gets any more awkward. Now, I'm, I'm just talking to my, my, uh, invisible, uh, 
you know, fairy who, who's in her lingerie. Anyways, hey Lola, I haven't, uh, I didn't know you still wait for Trap because airlines. It's good to see you. What are you up to these days? Wow, I really like your new uniform. Hmm. I, yeah, let's do this one, you know. Now, what do you have been up to these days? No, we, don't, we don't care about Tropica. Or maybe just flatter her straight up. Believe it or not, I started my own little fashion design business. I have a website and everything. It's still young, though, so I don't want to quit my day job just yet. Enough about me, though. Let's talk about you. What brings you out to Ina de Puna? It, Ina de Puna. Is, is that an actual... Is, is that a... What, what language is that? Is that an actual language, you, you know, used for that? Or, or, um... I, I don't know. I actually, I honestly don't know. And, uh, Ina de Puna. Does that mean, like... In the poon, P poon, P uh, poon in, P in poon, P poon, poon. That's all I know. Poon. All right. You wouldn't believe me if I told you. I thought I'd treat myself to a nice, relaxing vacation. I'm looking to score some of that sweet tropical tang. Tang. I, I that drink. You wouldn't believe me if I told you. <laughs> okay, you. Go ahead and keep your dirty secrets. I'm actually going to be enjoying a little time off on the island myself. I'm meeting up with an old friend of mine for a little vacay we've been planning forever. So, you want to join the Mile High Club? The, the, the Mile High Club? Oh, I... What's that? Some kind of rewards program? Lola Rembrandt, you naughty, naughty girl. Eh, hey, hey, no, no thanks. Yeah, you, you naughty. What? I work hard. A girl's gotta find some way to relieve a little stress, right? Yeah. I'm gonna pretend I have to go to the bathroom, but I'll leave the door unlocked. Wait a couple minutes so you don't raise any suspicion, okay? Oh, okay. Bro. We haven't even landed yet, and you're already scoring ass? Maybe this chick isn't as uptight as I thought. This is actually a great opportunity for me to teach you about double dates. What do you say? <gasps> That's a good idea. Good. Yes. That double date's good. Or that? No. Yeah, 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 yeah. No. Wait. Huh. Hold on. Wait, hold on. So, so, I've been, I've been, I, I've been using, I haven't been using any protection at all. Any protection? <sighs> do, do I got the Ghana, the Ghana Rhea, Ra Ra the crabs, the, the, the herpes? Uh, 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 you gotta wear protection, guys. Yeah. Ooh. Ah. Uh, uh. Hmm, I don't want, I don't want, I don't, I, I, I'm scared now, I'm scared. Do, do, do I have magic protection at least? Is, is that what happens? Oh, I don't, oh. Don't Google it, don't Google any of those STDs, STIs, they're horrible. And that's why you do not, that's why you gotta wear protection because you do not want to get any of those. Anyways, yeah, good idea, I've never had a double day before. All right, well, let's head in there. We don't want to keep her waiting, do we? You're right, you're right. Airplane cabin the next morning. Airplane bath in the tutorial day. Ooh. I've been so busy working, I don't even know how long it's been since I've gotten any. Oh. oh. All right, I'll try to make this quick because I know we all just want to get to the good part. You remember how dates work, right? Well, Double dates are similar, with a few key differences. The goal is still the same. You want to fill up the affection meter before you run out of moves. You do that by matching three or more of these tokens either horizontally or vertically. Well, affection tokens to be exact. Affection tokens are the circular ones with symbols on them. Like those three flirtation tokens over there. Go ahead and match those. You know, the green ones in the middle of the grid there. 
with the stars on them. Okay. Maybe I don't need the mouse. Yeah, because it's easier to just, you know, kind of see. All right. And it kind of distracts when I'm moving around like this. Anyways, besides that. Oh. Mmm, minus one stamina. Now, the biggest difference with double dates is obviously that there's two chicks. You gotta learn how to divide your time and attention between both girls. It can be a bit tricky. Right now, you're focused on me. To switch over to her, all you gotta do is click on her. Uh, oh. Uh oh, I can't just click on her on this? Okay. Easy sleazy. Now that you're focused on her, all the matches you perform will go to her. Okay, let's see. I'm trying to find some talent tokens for you to match. Oh, in the bottom left-hand corner, the blue ones with the music notes on them. Uh? Wait, the bottom one? But the, the what, what bottom? The, this? There's no way I can match this. Hello? Wait, in the bottom left corner, the blue ones with the... Oh, I didn't know I can go that far. Oh, I... Was it always like this? I, I don't remember. Of course, bigger matches, such as four or more in a row, will also give you more affection. Switch focus back over to me and I'll show you. You can use right click as a shortcut. Try it. Oh, cool. There's a four-of-a-kind romance token match somewhere on the grid. I'll let you find it. In case you forgot, romance tokens are the orange ones with the crescent shapes on them. Oh, okay. I, I see it. Wow. The thing with bigger matches that you gotta watch out for is that they also cost more stamina. <gasps> My stamina is looking pretty low right now, so let's find some stamina tokens to match. There. In the top right corner of the grid, match those stamina tokens. The white pentagon things. That's white? I thought it's gray. Yeah, maybe it, uh... Woo! That's better. The last thing you want to happen is for a girl to run out of stamina. If that happens, she'll be completely exhausted until her stamina fully recovers. I'm sure you remember the other token types, but I'll give you a quick refresher just in case. All right, thanks. The gold bells are called joy tokens. They give you extra moves. You can't beat that. The pink hearts are called passion tokens. Matching those increases a girl's passion. The higher her passion is, the more affection she'll give from affection token matches. Oh, uh, yeah. Broken hearts work a bit differently on double dates, but you still want to avoid them at all costs. Matching broken hearts will instantly drain a girl's stamina and put her in a bad mood. That's not even the worst part of it either. You want to know the worst part? If both girls are angry or exhausted, you're done. Yup, you failed. The date's over. So don't do that, okay? Okay. Is that everything? Can I shut up now? No, wait. Date gifts. Duh. How do I always forget about date gifts? I'm sure you didn't pack any, so I got you covered. Switch focus back over to her, will ya? Thanks. Man, this is uh this is very in-depth and oh man, I'm excited to um I'm I'm excited to uh, see where this game goes and I oh man, I this is a lot of stuff I need to know and This, this is just wow. Huh, morning. Man, it's been a while. I love this. I love these puzzle games. Here, she might like this one. It's from Honey Corp's newest line of date plushies. As usual, she'll need some sentiment before you're able to give her the date gift. I'll let you find a good sentiment token match. You're looking for the teal colored teardrops. Oh. Oh, I sees it. Hmm. 
And I just realized the, these uh, honey pop uh, or these icons, they remind me of the honey cam, right? The honey cam icons, right? Yeah. Perfect. That should be enough. You can give her the plushie now. Just drag it over to her. Oh, it's not the open button? Oh. <gasps> Removes all broken heart tokens from the grid? I I really miss Honey Pop. I really do. It was it's it was oh my gosh. And there's so much different models, everything. Alright, anyways. Yes, yeah, here you go. Plus four. Oh that's why oh the oh the sentiment thing. Gotcha. Right here. There Doggo. you go. Honeycorp has tons of new and classic date gifts for sale. So try them all. And that's it. Well, those are most of the basics of double dating anyway. I know it's a lot to take in, but don't worry. You'll get the hang of it. Now finish up this date so we can do what we came here to do. Or rather, who we came here to do. <laughs> I'll make sure you can't fail this one. Just try not to screw it up too bad, okay? Wait. I don't plan on failing. You think you think I came to I came in, you know, to plan on failing? <laughs> Meh. Meh. Oh, look at that boom, baby. Beautiful. All right. Um, we need we need um. All right. So we need blue and oh 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 shoes. Alright, so she likes blue and green. Any any green? We got blue. But we do need stamina. Alright, so this is the blue. We got minus one, it's fine. Alright, let's do it. Change back to her. Alright, we got red. Uh need big red. Oh wait, no, hold on. Ah, okay, so Oh, here we go, boom Yeah, it's a big one Excellent Alright, so Make it her Okay, so it increases regardless Alright, that's good, that's good Good to know Okay, what, what And then she gets stamina. Okay, this is good. This is good. This is a good learning curve or learning uh, tutorial, and I like it. Okay, we need. No, there's no. Okay, so we need red. Okay, right, good, good. Uh. Any more, any more stuff that I, I, I remember I'm blind. I'm blind to a lot of this stuff. All right. Just, if I'm missing something, it's cause I'm blind. Where? Oh, yeah, 16 moves. Oh, 16 moves. All right. We got 16 moves. Uh, I need, um, Okay. Okay. Uh, uh, sorry. When, when I'm when I'm uh, when I'm when I'm stressed out, it, it's bad. Okay. Um. Any red? Red here? Oh, that was it. Where, where are these fruits coming from? Well. Are we just gonna sit and catch up, or are you gonna take that thing out? All right, now it's time for the ahem, bonus round. This is the part where you fug the girls. 
What the fuck? Unfortunately, I have to sit this one out or I'll have to go through abstinence training. Again. But the bonus round is pretty simple. Just forget everything I just taught you about double dates. And match tokens as fast as you can. It doesn't matter which ones, just keep matching. Oh. Try not to stop or slow down. Getting two girls to climax simultaneously requires some serious sexterity. Oh, oh, oh. All right, bonus round, guys. Yo, whoa, oh my. Um. Oh, oh my. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. I don't know what's going on. Up, uh, uh, um, uh, up. Oh, I did. Oh, oh, uh, mm, oh, oh, uh, mm, oh, mm, oh, 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 mm. Okay, all right. I think we we actually we, I don't know why what you're doing there. Just, um, mm, mm, mm. Oh shit! Was I way too loud? Fuck! I was trying to keep it down. Great work! I couldn't have phoned her better myself. Well, maybe a little better. Oh oh my! Airplane bathroom. Airplane be cabin. Beginning our descent. Well, that was certainly refreshing. <laughs> Hopefully nobody saw us walk out together. Oh, I saw a lot more than that. Perfect timing, too. Looks like we're about to begin our descent. I better go take my seat. You still have my number, right? Give me a ring so we can meet up on the island. Oh, okay, I, I you got your By phone. By the way, you're probably wondering why a bunch of fruit popped out of us after the date, huh? Well, out here in the tropics, honey takes a slightly different form than you're used to. Instead of that weird pink jelly stuff, it manifests as what we call honey seeds. Don't worry, you can still use them to buy gifts and other useful items from the honeybee. Oh, look, there it is. I can see the island. We're almost there. Mm, mm, mm. I can practically taste all that delicious clam already. I'm confused. I don't know where all those fruits came from. I, they, they just popped out of nowhere. I don't know. Ah, uh, Ina de Puna, where the melons are juicy and the fish are plenty. Yeah, I, I don't, I don't like, I don't like fish. I like the fruits though. I just don't know where they came from and came out of, out of the, 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 the booty or the, 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 the other, the, 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 um, the other cave. Can I go? Can I? Can you find me without making a sexual innuendo? Innuendo? Okay, have you ever visited this island before? Can't wait to get started on those three sums. Uh, have you visited this island before? Of course. This is a very popular vacation spot for us love fairies. Oh. There's just something about this place that makes you feel all warm and fuzzy in the lady bits. Uh, oh. What the fuck is that? Hey, look over there. Isn't that your little sex buddy from home? How oh. convenient is that? Oh, uh, who? Um, dude, stalk much? <laughs> what in the fuck are you doing here? Oh, I I don't know. Uh, it's yeah, uh, it's kind of hard to explain. Me? What? What in the app are you doing here? Uh, yeah, I stalked you out here. What? What of it? Yeah, kind of hard to me. Uh, yeah, I stalked you out here. Don't, don't. Look, don't worry, it's not. It's, it's just a little stalking, I think. I don't. Maybe. Mm, sure. What if I press escape? Face bar. Nothing. I, I can't do anything. All right, gotcha. Understood. All right. Yeah, I stalked you. Oh, cool. Nothing alarming about that. No, not creepy at all. Oh, thanks. Dude, if you wanted to fly out here with me, all you had to do was ask. If I'd have known you were coming, I wouldn't have had to explain my vibrator to security. Oh my god. I love her. You already have an in with this chick too. 
Now all we gotta do is convince her to have a three-way. Hey, Ash, are you down for a three-way? I'm not just some sex toy you can use. I'm sure we can still find a good use for that vibrator. Is, is this like a massager thing? Is this, is this just what the vibrator's for? I don't, I, I think. Uh, yeah. That's true. Plenty of holes to fill, right? <laughs> Bro, where did you find this chick? I want one. I don't know. I have some business stuff to take care of out here, but... I should have plenty of free time, too. I'm staying at... What was the name? Oh, yeah. Lovely. Lovely Hotel. What a coincidence. That's exactly where we'll be staying, too. Oh. Anyway, I should probably go find my luggage. Catch you later, sweet cheeks. Oh. Oh, man. I am definitely sneaking into her room at night to get a whiff of that. Uh, Speaking of which, we should go check in before it gets too late. Come on, let's go! Okay. Oh my gosh. Well, in the Dapuna. Here, here, here we go. Pretty sweet digs, huh? If you're gonna try to save the galaxy, you might as well do it in style. Good evening. Welcome to Lovely Hotel. My name is Lailani. How may it be of service? I can think of a few ways this cutie pie could be of service to me. <laughs> just checking in, thank you. I'm not sure, I was just told to come here. What kind of service do you offer exactly? Well, um, this is the front desk, so all I can do is help guests get checked in and out. But I don't remember seeing any more reservations in the system for tonight. Shit! I knew I forgot to do something. Uh, not a problem, though. I'm sure we can find the appropriate accommodations for you. What kind of room were you looking for? Uh, I'll take any room you have that's available. Give me the most expensive and luxurious room you've got, because I got money. Um, do I, do I have money? I think I'm poor, right? I don't, I don't know. Maybe you and I could share a room together. <laughs> I'm afraid that would be strictly against hotel policy. <laughs> what? What policy? I think. But I do have a great room for you on the second floor. It has a nice view and a big bed. I think you'll find it to be quite suitable. Excuse me briefly while I retrieve your key card. Okay, is it expensive? Okay, you're all set. Here's your key card. The room number is written on the back. The 69? If you need anything else, please don't hesitate to ask. That's what we're here for. I think I'm good for now. Thanks, L Lailani. I, can you lotion and... Can you have lotion and tissue sent up to my room? A massage would be nice. Then you'll be quite happy to learn that we have a massage bar right here within the resort. You can go there anytime to make an appointment with one of our therapists. Ooh. He might even get me. <laughs> oh. The elevator is behind you to your right. Enjoy your stay and have a wonderful night. Wait, can I can I can I go to the menu yet? I'm kind of waiting. <gasps> Morning, sunshine. I hope you slept well, cause we've got a full day of double dates ahead of us. You remember how the honeybee registers the girls you meet and tracks their location, right? Yeah. Well, now it can also detect the presence of girls that you haven't even met yet. Just open up the Girl Finder app and select a location where two girls are going to be. The honeybee will automatically detect if the girls are compatible with each other. If they are, you can probably coax them into a threesome. Oh. But it might take a date or two. Oh. Oh. Oh, I see, I see. Huh. All right. Can I save? Yes, I. I guess I can save. Yeah. Let's let's, let's go. Let's go. Let's learn more about a. Uh, you know, La Ashley. Let's, let's, let's learn more about her. Alright! I'm psyched, 
You sight? Yeah, you're sight. Let's go get you laid. I, uh, oh, and if you ever need to check in with me, just meet me back here at the hotel room. Are, are there any secret stuff I need to know? I need to, to do. I need to. Hey, I'm glad you're here. This is perfect. You know that famous telly Uba chick I mentioned? Oh. Well, I'm meeting her here any minute now to plan our collab video. It just so happens we're gonna need a camera guy. So, make yourself useful, will ya? Think of it as an opportunity to pay me back for everything I do for you. Or everything I let you do to me, to be exact. <laughs> but why do I let you home? Oh my gosh, Ashley! I can't believe we finally get to meet in person. Who this? Well, if it isn't Polly Bendelson herself. Uh, ben? It's great to meet you, girlfriend. Bendelson. This is so exciting. I've wanted to collab with you ever since I first saw your quickie pick page. Believe me, the feeling is mutual. It's a huge opportunity for us both. By the way, I'd like you to meet my friend here. He's my new camera guy. Oh my, what a handsome young man. I am? <laughs> I'm Polly. Delighted to make your acquaintance. Not half as delighted as I am to make yours. I can understand why I'm extremely delightful. Videography is, own, is but only one of my many, many talents. Hmm, I'm a, I'm a flatterer. Uh, I'm a flatterer. No, my talents, I got many. Oh, is that so? Well, I'm very much looking forward to discovering your other talents. Ooh, Southern ah, accent. Ah, shit. You know what? I forgot my tripod. Hold on, I'll be right back. Two minutes tops. Well, take your time, girl. It's a chance for me to get to know your cute friend better. <laughs> huh. That's weird. How come the honeybee isn't registering this chick? No, wait. There it goes. Huh. That's never happened before. Must be a bug or something. Anyway, I'm getting a traditional vibe from this broad. She's probably looking for a classy guy. So try to wait at least 10 fucking seconds before you whip your dick out. Can you do that? I don't know what's going on. Wait, can she see her? Can she see Q? She's looking at her. She's looking at her. Look at her. Her eye, her eye she's just staring right at her. Hmm. <gasps> what if she's a, what if she's a secret? She's, she's some secret fairy. Hmm. Anyways, Ashley, Ashley tells me you're a tele-uber. I don't know what the tele-uber is, but uh, like a telephone, like a, like a telephone about you or something? I don't know. Telegraph. I really dig this wild outfit you're wearing. How do you get your hair to stay up like that? Lots of hairspray. I like the outfit. Uh, tell me about the, nah, it's, yeah. Oh, you like it? I came up with it myself. I'm just a little bit obsessed with retro fashion. <laughs> Fine by me. I run a beauty channel called Polly's Paradise. You ever hear of it? Uh, Paradise? Oh. Uh, no, but Ashley says you're super famous. Now that you mention it, I think I've seen your videos before. I just go on there to watch people play video games. Uh, no, I've never heard of it. I, oh, uh, I, but Ashley says you're super famous. I think I've seen yeah, no. No, I'm sorry. I, I play video. I watch people play video games. How fun! Oh. I could never figure out how those things work. I need somebody to teach me. Yeah, I, mean, I don't know how it works, too. That's, that's why I watched it. All right, got the tripod. Ready to go scouting for a good location? I sure am. Will your cute friend be joining us? I'm the. I'm the yep. We wouldn't want to be out there without a decent camera guy, would we? <laughs> Combatability detected. Oh my. Oh my. Here we go. Oh. But any so anyways, I'm gonna end the episode here, everybody, for Honey Pop 2 Double Date. Oh my goodness, this game, I this mm, I, I don't know what's going on, but man, oh man, this game has a lot of stuff. And I am excited. I'm excited to see where this game will take us. And man, oh man. Ugh, the, the, the yellow, that that big yellow, ye yellow, the the my, ooh, the yellow, the do, 
stolen icon the yellow demonetization is, is, is super hard on this one so it's it's hit super hard but anyways link <laughs> link that is down below in the description for you guys check this game out yourself and because i'm pretty sure you guys probably most likely would want to play this yourself i'm just i'm just saying out you know out there that you guys will probably want to play yourself but anyways um uh i uh will um have or will um have uploaded uh uh on the main channel uh would be my you know my facial expression with my webcam and all that but on the anime channel, there uh, there'll be no webcam, so you guys can see, you know, you guys can choose which one you guys want to watch, um, my reactions or my no reactions. But I mean, that's your choice. So, anyways, thank you everybody for watching. If you guys enjoyed it, then please smash that like button, subscribe down below for more awesome videos. Don't forget to ring that little bell to get notifications of my uploads. Thank you everybody for watching this episode, and I will see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.